Good morning, everybody. It's Joe and Funny Bunny again from Daniel's Den. And today we are launching a new term of crafts and it's all based on living things. And we have got so many wonderful crafts that will have you cutting and sticking and ripping and printing and painting and so much more and we are so looking forward to sharing these with you. Um, I'm so excited about this first craft because we're going to make two crafts and it's based on one of our songs which I will share the, the video, the YouTube video about jump like a flea and buzz like a bee and it's a wonderful rhyming song about different little insects and I was just sat here in the Daniel's Den office and I found this and can you see it's some hand wash and it says be happy oh my gosh we want everybody to be happy this term and I think by coming to Daniel's Den having a safe place to come and play with others to make new friends to experience new toys and, the, and activities it makes us happy and if you're happy we're happy as I often say if mommy or daddy isn't happy isn't nobody happy and that's why we're here for Daniel's Den to bring fun and laughter and just to help everybody's mental health and sense of well-being so be happy our first craft of this term is to make a bumblebee and funny bunny and i are going to show you how to do that right now have you noticed our new banner isn't that fantastic we have this new banner and we're using it to advertise daniel's den because do you know what in a recent survey in the civic center in brent 70% of people had never heard of Daniel's Den. I was shocked. And we really want as many people to know about Daniel's Den as possible so they can enjoy the fun. So anyway, without further ado, I'm going to show you how to make a bee. So if anybody's sitting down, are you watching? Yep. And here we go. And here is what we need to make a bee. I don't, we don't need sellotape. But look, a cardboard tube, some yellow um, tissue paper, a little wing, and a little circle. And that's how we go. And a glue stick. Oh, where's my glue stick? Oh, there it is. Oh, but look what I forgot to do. I forgot to put the lid on it. Bunny Bunny is not very happy about that. That's how we waste our glue sticks. So here we are. Look, we're putting the glue on here. And listen, we like to recycle things. We have a recycling po po policy. Linda, one of our fantastic um, staff members, she's all about sustainability. And we love to use everyday objects that you have around your house in our crafts. So look, I've put glue on there and then I wrap the the tube in this yellow tissue paper if you don't have yellow tissue paper you could color the tube yellow or you could look and see if you've got any scrap paper around that's yellow and then look tuck those ends in there um, just like that so there we are that is the body of our bumblebee and then we are going to give our bumblebee some stripes now in our packs we have some stripes cut out but i'm going to cut these out with the scissors children love um cutting and it's a really good thing for children to do like obviously cutting straight lines for this is a bit tricky for your two-year-olds but you know even just giving them old newspapers and one of our activities this term is to be cutting things out of magazines and um, it's just so good for their fine motor skills or when they're learning to write so there is the black stripe and then carefully we put some glue around there and we stick it around the bumblebee. Let's see if it fits. Are you watching? Oh, just about. Oh, I'll make that the back where the wing goes. So glue on there. So again, we can count how many stripes we've got. There's so many learning opportunities when you're doing crafts with your children. It's not about it looking perfect. It's about having fun in the process. So I do this very, very quickly, obviously, because you don't want to 
video to, to go very slowly. Um, but this is such a great thing to do with your toddlers, with older children. So look, there is the body of the bee. It's already starting to look like a bee. And here, let's give the bee a little face. We do have some, oh, oh, something sticking to my finger. We do have some um, sticky eyes, which may be available in your packs, but it's not necessary. So here, look, I'm putting the eyes on there and I'm giving my bee a big smile. Can you see that? And then, of course, bees need little antennae. So I'm going to cut these out. At our groups, these may already be cut out, um, but you know, it's always good to show you how to do it. Yesterday, we had a team of, I think there was five of us or six of us, and we prepared all the crafts for all our groups, 2,600 crafts. My gosh, what a team we had working on that. And look, there's our bee, can you see? And I'm going to stick his head on there just like that. Doesn't that look beautiful? And last but not least is the wing. And this is very fine tissue paper. And I just put a little bit of glue down the middle and I'm going to stick it on the back. So that there is the wing of the bee. Now, in order to make it fly, we are going to attach some strings to our bee. But sadly, I don't have any string in the office, so I've got found some old wrapping um, tape that I'm going to use. So I'm just going to thread that through the body of the bumblebee. Can you see? Oh my gosh. And then I'm going to tie it in a knot at the top. This is where you definitely need an adult to help. Let's have a look and do it like this. Oops, tie it tight. Oh dear, I'm getting the wing all a bit creased up. Tie it like this. You can do it however you want. And let's have a look. Let's have a look. Can you see that? Oh, look at his face. has gone all lopsided. Let's move that round. And there's the wing. And there is our B isn't that amazing funny bunny loves it now we have this song that says buzz jump like a flea and buzz like a bee and in our packs in our groups you can also make a flea so there is the oh there is the flea and there is the bee and because they're on string we can make them both hop up and down or fly around. It is really as simple as that. And have you noticed the top that I'm wearing? It's all flowers. And <coughs> this time of year, the flowers are coming out. The bees are waking up and they're going to make honey, which is wonderful. Anyway, Funny Bunny is so happy that we've been able to bring you our first video. So 